host Fania Chaplin and as part of the DevSecOps Delivered series, I'm going to show you how to use Nexus Firewall with Nexus Repository Manager OSS. First, I need to set up the firewall capability. I can do this by going to the configuration. First, I need to set up my IQ server. So I need to set it up with my IQ server URL and authentication method. Then go to capabilities and I'm going to create a capability. You can see here IQ audit and quarantine. I need to do three things. Tick, enable this capability. Select my proxy repository, then enable quarantine. You can see this capability has been created. To showcase this, I'm going to do a build in Eclipse. I've set up some Maven goals, so it's purging my local repository. So that way, when I'm running this build, you can see here it's downloading all the artifacts from my repository. If I go to my IQ server, the way Firewall works is based on policies. Here is an example set of policies and Firewall works at the proxy stage as a form of ingress control. So you can see here for security high, I have the fail. If I go back to my IDE, you can see build failure commons collection. When I go back to my repository, what I have here is a column IQ policy violation and you can see by the symbols one component has been quarantined. If I click here, I get a repository bill of materials with all of the components that I have downloaded and all of the policy violations. If I go here, I can see Commons Collection has been quarantined and you can see Policy Security High Proxy Fail. If I did want to release this component, all I need to do is waive the policy and then release it from quarantine. And now I can see Commons Collection has no violations. So this is how to use Firewall, the Nexus Repository Manager, OSS.